In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can create a sport YouTube end screen right in Filmora. Before we proceed, don't forget to click on the subscribe button and turn on the notification bell so you won't miss any video in the future. Let's start by launching Filmora, and you can see I've imported some video clips for this project. First, let's go to Split Screen tab and choose your desired split screen design. For me, I'm choosing this one with four frames, divided equally on screen. Now drag and drop your footage one by one according to what you want them to be on screen and adjust their scales and positions respectively. Now, from the Media tab, drag a clip and drop on the timeline, then trim it to your desired length. Then trim the clip again around here and go to Effect tab and search here, Blur. Drag the square blur to the second part of the clip and adjust the blur intensity by increasing the size. Next, I'll drop another video clip onto the timeline and add a dissolve transitions between the first two cut. Also adjust the transition duration if needed. Then I'm going to add a profile picture, and I'll drag this image on the second track above the second clip. Then go to Utility Category under the Effects tab. Select Image Mask, drag it onto the clip we just placed. Double click on it and adjust its masking width and the XY axis position to make the person face fit in the circle mask. Then add a border effect under Utility Category as well. And now, let's add a drop shadow for the profile picture. You can tweak the shadow distance, blurriness, color, and opacity according to your project. Scale down the picture and place it at the center of the frame. And now, let's go to the Elements tab to add a YouTube subscribe button icon. Simply search YouTube, and I'll use this. Drag it to the third track on top of the person track, and adjust the position accordingly. Now, let's add an end screen template for YouTube. Go to the Social Media category under the Titles tab. Select your favorite one and add to the timeline right above the last clip. I'll add transitions to the front and end of profile picture track. Then duplicate it on top of the end screen and make it fit into the circle. and add a transition at the beginning of the clip. Then, I want to add some assets to spice up the end screen. Go to the Effects tab, and I'll add this purple flare on top of the end screen. Lastly, I'll change the text here to my own social media account, and voila! You get yourself a YouTube cool sporty YouTube end screen for your channel. If you would like to recreate this, you can simply click Import Template at the bottom left of the video in Filmora Creator Academy to get the project files and replace the default media with your clips. If you would like to learn more about video editing, don't forget to subscribe and turn on the notification bell to stay updated when we upload new videos in the future. Do check out other tutorials on this channel and comment below to let us know what you would like to learn next. Till next time, stay creative with Filmora.